31st. It was another day of Redskins OTAs and another day without Matt Jones Wednesday in Ashburn. But despite indications, Jones is likely on his way out. Jay Gruden was adamant. He wants Jones back. You know, I, I hope so. I expect him to be he's on our roster. You know, he's eating up a spot, but, you know, we all know that this is voluntary. So there's really nothing that we can do. We'd like everybody to be here without a doubt. But at the end of the day, you know, Jordan Reed's in Miami working out. Trent's working out in Oklahoma. Matt Jones chose not to be here. So, uh, you know, we obviously want people to work together and learn together, but it is voluntary at the end of the day. All right, that's Ashburn. This is Kansas City, and Patrick Mahomes was on the field Wednesday. If you're trying to guess which rookie quarterback starts first this year, you probably wouldn't take Mahomes, but he said Wednesday he is making progress. Granted, it's a process. Uh, yeah, I mean, just really diving into the playbook, getting up to speed on trying to catch up to where these guys are, and uh, really just going through the motions, learning from mistakes, and getting better every rep. I don't know if it's it, if I'm that far away. It's just more about I just got to keep working, keep getting better. I mean, these veterans are guys who've been around the league, been in the league, and are, have been very successful. So in order to be like them, I got to really go as hard as they do and catch up to them. Hey, this is good to see Wednesday in Minnesota. Teddy Bridgewater still recovering from that horrible knee injury last August on the field, doing individual drills, actually throwing the football. Also did some light running and some work to the side with the trainers. Not back anytime soon, but it is certainly a good sign. Meantime, in Dallas, Nolan Carroll on the field Wednesday for the Cowboys at the Star. This after an early morning Monday arrest on DWI charges. Well, it's just disappointing. Uh, obviously, it's a very serious issue. And it's an issue that hits close to home uh, to us. And uh, it's something that uh, we just have to all learn from. He has to learn from it individually. We have to learn from it uh, as coaches, players, staff members, and everybody. Because uh, it's a disappointing situation. There's no excuse or no explanation for it. I'm Andrew Siciliano, and that's what you need to know.